for multiplying, like number 9, remember we multiply straight across the top and straight across the bottom. So 3 times 1 on the top gives me 3. 8 times 4 on the bottom gives me 32. Can I divide anything into both 3 and 32? No. Because the only thing that's going into 3 are 3 and 1, and 3 does not go into 32. So that problem is done right there. That's it. 330 seconds. I like multiplication of all the fraction stuff because it usually is the easiest. All right, we're going to repeat the process here with number 10. Multiply across the top, we get 3. Multiply across the bottom, we get 24. So we have 3 24ths. Does that reduce? Yes, because I can divide both top and bottom of this one by 3, which would give me 1 8th. Number 11, we're dividing. The first thing I need to do is I need to rewrite the problem where I flip the second fraction, always the second, and then change the division and multiplication. That is not two separate steps. It is one step where you flip and change it to multiplication. Having done that, you can go ahead and do your multiplication. We end up with 8 fifths. If you went ahead and changed it into a mixed number, you would get 1 and 3 fifths here, but you did not have to do that. We'll worry about the mixed number part later. So 8 fifths would be a fine answer, and notice it does not reduce because there's nothing other than 1 that goes into both 8 and 5. Repeat the process here for number 12. We got 8 ninths. Change it to multiplication when we flip the second fraction. And then we can multiply straight across the top and straight across the bottom. And then we can reduce the 24 eighteenths. Now what can we divide 24 and 18 by? Well, there is 2, there's also 3, and there's also 6. 6 is the biggest one. So I'm going to go ahead and divide top and bottom by 6. If you divide it by 2, let's say, you'll get a fraction that can be reduced further, so you get that, and then you would keep going and keep reducing. But by dividing by 6, I don't have to worry about taking it any further. I end up with 4 thirds, and then that's the final answer and where we stop.